I don't like the route, but it's a better route. Two fifteen. Either way, I guess. Okay. Really? Oh, come on. I was not... What the hell if I could see where the hell I'm going here? See where we're at now. Price eight twenty six. He's dropping really fast, so I may only get two of these. But canola's up. Ten forty nine, ten fifty nine at the warehouse. Oh, ten fifteen. Oh, eleven nineteen at the flour mill. Yes, I'll be selling some of that next. Eleven nineteen at the flour mill. That's uh, fine. Just for the fun of it, I'm going to take this road. See if I hate it. Yeah, I'm already not really a fan. I could get interrupted any minute. <clears throat> Go to no low commentary. Wasn't sure where this road was going here, so I kind of... Okay, it's got a little jog in it. That's why I don't like it that much. Almost hit that tree. Watch out for that tree. Watch out for that tree. The trouble with uh, great demands is by the time you dump two big loads, the price really drops. And uh, Not that great. I mean, it's better than... I suppose I shouldn't look a gift horse in the mouth, but... This is what I'd like all the episodes to be like. A lot of action, a lot of money, a lot of options. Um, 
So this is what I'll be striving for, and that means I'll be doing some planting harvest cycles off camera. So that the episodes move along faster and are more interesting. So with this money, we should be able to get into sugar beets. And I'm not sure... Yeah, I'd still like to have another tractor-trailer uh, for harvest without using the truck all the time. Or maybe get another truck. That wouldn't be a bad idea, actually, get another truck and tra trailer. Let's see, the canola is number three, isn't it? Canola is going to the flour mill. Okay. Coolness. suppose that means we buy a field 15. I wonder how much that is. Now we need to position harvest equipment at 16 and 10. By that time it'll be time to position it at uh, 19 also. I don't know if I can make this turn at full speed. <laughs> we'll see. There aren't too many obstacles in the way. Oh, yeah. That works good. That wool building up. Yeah, I definitely need another truck because I need more options. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hey, I should try this. See if I can do this. Can I get a, a full load across the tracks here? <laughs> But work. So if I'm really in a hurry, or if I just drive that carelessly again, I can just go right through there. This should take us well over a three hundred thousand, almost three fifty. I'd like to have twelve, but you know, whatever. Yeah, I see the wheat's down to seven sixty already, which you know is, is better than six, but. Oh well. Yeah, we're not gonna make three fifty, are we? Well that's a disappointment, but oh well. One more load and we'll have four fifty. I can spend about four hundred thousand. I need to keep about fifty thousand for harvest. But if I use follow me, I don't have to spend that much money on harvest, because I've been spending about fifty thousand dollars on hired hands. Oh god, I'm not even sure I can get this lined up here. There isn't room. This is, uh, I'm gonna have to go to another corner. Yeah, I'm gonna have to go to the far corner. Dang it. I wanna be pipe out, you know, all the way around. But that dumb squeaky windmill and clothesline are in the way to get lined up there. Oh boy. Okay, um, so we're about ready to do this. You know, I need to get this positioned because if I'm staying at... This is so much easier to position than that other thing. Oh my god. Why did it do that?
There. Okay. I guess the planting I'll do automated, except possibly I might use Follow Me for uh, if I have another tractor. <sighs> Whatever. Okay. Um, yeah, let's let's start this and uh, try to do this uh, one field with Follow Me, see if it works, and that may be about it for the day. Let's see. Do I need uh, I need to unfold, don't I? I suppose I could disable the chopper. Okay, then, yeah, well, that doesn't have. Now, I don't know if I have to tell the truck to stay off to the side or. This is going to be interesting. I don't think this is going to follow. Yeah, at all. I have to... I may not have done enough of a trail either. That was kind of ineffective, ineffective, wasn't it? Okay, is there enough of a trail crumb to do this? Okay. And then, oh my god, I need... Actually, why won't that change now? I have no idea what this is going to do. Um, Show next stations. What does that mean? Oh, okay, because I'm in. Alright, I get back to the... This is a little bit tedious. At least with a harvest... Okay, I definitely need to be out farther. Uh, about eight, maybe. How come that doesn't change?
Well, let me see what happens. I think I'm going to have to turn that off and then get it back to... Uh, I don't know if that's going to work or not. Yes, it is. Okay. Cool. I don't know about the minus 10. I don't think that's doing anything. Maybe it's 10 ahead of being, being behind. I was thinking it was 10 from the actual combine, but... That's pretty cool. I like that a lot. I'm going to try like minus five next time and see what happens. And I'm also curious about this turn. Not exactly turning on a dime, but close enough for government work. And I don't know if this will go any faster or not. <clears throat> Actually turned better than I thought it would. I'm going to gently straighten it out here so the truck doesn't get in the way. I really, really like that. A lot. Follow Me is the greatest mod ever in Farming Simulator. Now if I could just steer straight. Yep. Yeah. Okay, let's see if I can start this corner a little f earlier now and make it a little cleaner. And you see I do still have the option to um, steer away from the edge of the field a little bit. Okay, what happens if I speed this up? Is this all going to yell at me now? truck will keep up. It just does it in increments, kind of. Let's see if I can make this corner now at a faster speed. <laughs> Oopsie, now it started to veer off a little on me, so... Yeah, we gotta slow down the slow down time. I'll be able to see how crooked I am when I look at these windrows. That's one good reason to disable the chopper. But look at that, I'm not spending any money doing harvest. And 
That was very poorly done. I'm going to regret that decision. Okay. We're doing good. Doing good. Doing good. Oh, well, that went crooked, didn't it? Wasn't paying attention to that. Have to pick that up a little later on the next round. I figured it was going to do that, but I, I didn't think I was moving that fast. <laughs> I was writing down offsets. Yeah, we'll be coming back for that, too. I really tend to steer too much to the right, don't I? Okay, well, I'm going to get interrupted here in a minute. So I'll finish this field with uh, no low commentary. And um, next time we'll uh, we'll do another field. We'll follow and then maybe try a few things and buy some stuff. How's that? Thought I lost the, bread, the trail crumb for a second there, but he caught up. That's going to do it for me. Thanks for watching. Join me next time when Tenacious Viking plays Harmon Smoker 2013, Westbridge Hills.